This is from Dog Pound Daily. Three free agents Browns fans will want, uh, but they won't be signed. Uh, number three, defensive tackle Shelby Harris. Number two, running back Ezekiel Elliott. Elliot and number one, the aforementioned DeAndre Hopkins. Um, I'm still not sure that Hopkins is going to get the 15 million that he's looking for. Although the you know the the Patriots do have some money. Um, just your thoughts. I, I think Hopkins is still a possibility. I don't think it's likely, but I think it's a possibility. Yeah, it's not off the table by any means. There's no way you could point to this wide receiver room and say it would be worse. I think DeAndre Hopkins, but uh, I'll point to the first guy on that list, Shelby Harris. Man, he's a quality defensive tackle, and if there becomes a way to, to manage to get him on the team, I don't, I don't see the Browns turning him down. You know, uh, like would come down to money, obviously, but I don't think he's going to be someone who commands so high of a salary that it's just off the table. Now he is more of a run-stuffing defensive tackle, and uh, given the addition of Dalvin Thomason and you drafted Ika. I could see that them if they did add another defensive tackle to make that more of the pass rushing variety like a Matt Ioannidis. But then we can move on to Ezekiel Elliott. I, all that talks crazy to me. I don't, I don't see a path. I don't see a way that Andrew Barry is looking to add a veteran like that, given the fact that they just let go of a veteran in Cream Hunt for the same reason that you would not sign an Ezekiel Elliott. Yeah. You know, if you're looking for a guy who's just lost a step and has limitations. I don't think that you bring Ezekiel Elliott, and that doesn't make any sense to me. No, I, I think the only way you get a veteran, um, if you, if somehow Dalvin Cook wants to be reunited and it's at a lower dollar figure, or if there's a pass catcher that you can use effectively out of the backfield, I think that's the only way they add veterans.